The VCU Create-A-Thon took place over spring break, featuring over 50 students who participated. Kurt Dozier is joined in the studio by two guests. I'm here with director of Create-A-Thon, Peyton Rowe, and a senior advertising major, John Kincaid. And Peyton, how are you today? I'm doing very well. How are you? I'm good. The motto is meet cool people, make cool stuff, help cool groups. Could you talk a little bit about what Create-A-Thon is? I'm absolutely happy to do that. Create-A-Thon on campus, which is actually the college version of what we're doing here, um, is a way for students in, in uh, all kinds of majors to work with nonprofits, um, not only for a long period of time over the course of a semester, but the real fun of it is our 24-hour Creative Blitz where we start at 8.30 on, on a Thursday morning and, and at about 8.30 the next morning, then pitch it to the clients. Um, it's based on a professional model, uh, and I created the, the college version about three years ago and started at VCU, and, and so far, so good. We keep doing it every year. Yeah, I mean, it, this is the, the third time, and it's the VCU is the first university to launch this program. And John, what's your impressions of, you know, you're working around the clock for, for nonprofit organizations. What can you take from an experience like Create-A-Thon on campus? Um, I think it's a, it's a really great experience. I think it's a, it's a great creative environment. You know, I mean, you're, you're thrown into the situation where you have to get it done by the next morning. And there are more than enough helping hands uh, around there to give you feedback. And I think you learn a lot about your own talents and, uh, you know, really what you're capable of doing. Now, Peyton, over 50 students participated in this activity, 24-hour, round-the-clock, help for nonprofit organizations. What was the process in selecting which organizations you were able to help? There, it's really a year-long program if you look at the whole process. We solicit applications from the Richmond area beginning in October. We got over 83 applications this year, which is up from previous years 63 and previous years 43 so there's no no hurting for people to help out there um, when we receive the applications I have a review committee that that reads through them and selects them based on on some key criteria first of all being little to no marketing budget that's a very important piece of the puzzle the second is they need to be within a 30 mile radius of the Richmond area and that's so that we can grow it to other markets the third is are the projects really well suited or particularly well suited for college? Um, and then the other two are sort of just nitty gritty. Is it a sustainable project? Is the group big enough to make it work? Um, <clears throat> but those are the ba five basic criteria we use. And I have a, a collection of professionals, fellow professors, non people in the nonprofit community to help me review them because I want it to be as, as fair and across the board as possible. Yeah, most definitely. <laughs> uh, n now, John, what's it like working with, you know, other people that, that you're close to, that you're in class with, for, for a nonprofit organization, a good cause? Do you feel more rewarded in that, or what's yeah, your feeling? Yeah, uh, definitely. Um, I think it's a, it's a lot more rewarding to not only be coming up with something for a company that really can't afford to do it by themselves, but also just the fact that, you know, you're you're actually pitching it to the customer the next morning. You know, this isn't a, a a mock pitch, and you and they really love anything that you can come up with. You know, and I just think it's it's so good, like it's so beneficial to everybody. Okay, now Peyton, if you if there's one person that wants to get involved in the Create-a-Thon on campus, what would be a little piece of advice that you would give them? Well, it, it depends on how they want to get involved. If it's a student, absolutely contact me, and I can get you in touch with how to be involved and get involved with other students. If you're a professional mentor, you know, come to me, we'll get you to help the students along. If you're a nonprofit, also come to me, but we also have a website at www.createthononcampus.org. And uh, most of the information you need should be there. We're revamping it right now. But uh, there's always a place for people to get involved. Okay, Peyton Rowe, thank you so much. John, thank you so much as well. Create-a-thon on campus, led by Peyton Rowe and participated by John Kincaid.